Continentex 211 Educating the youths through films No! 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 It's a lie! <laughs> okay, best friends, you guys are welcome. I just have something. I just have one thing to say. Well, I just one thing, Kirare. It's not gonna take even five minutes. Just, you know, a little bit. So, there is this guy who called me, you know. It's not only one person. I receive a lot of calls. But this one particular one called me. Hey, a tongue. You know, I have a lot of names. Sometimes they call me a tongue. Seki, na, Jurua, Seki, Stella, Sunday, Oja, but whatever it is. I have Angongo, Mama. I have multiple names, a lot of names. So he called me. Hey, Atom. <laughs> I said, yeah. We just talked. We are communicating. We are just, you know, the energy. Me, I, I am this person who, if, 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 I, if I start talking to you, like, I just talk, you know, I don't care. So we are just talking. The talking was really good and all that. So this guy happened to ask me, hey, Atom, Sariyari, do you have a boyfriend? Well, are you dating somebody? I said, hey, I have two breasts on my chest. I have two breasts on my chest that shows that I'm a, I'm a lady. Did you think I will not date somebody for what? I have to date. Yes, I'm dating somebody. Hmm? I'm a woman. They have to come for me. Eh? Yeah, so I said, yeah, I'm dating somebody. So what was that? <laughs> he asked, oh. Yeah, and the boyfriend, take him in when? Where is your boyfriend from? You know how you want, you, you feel like pulling people's leg, right? Right? I just, just thought I should pull his leg. I said, he is Kawaja. He is Kawaja. <laughs> so when I said he is Kawaja, he was. Adon? Are you dating Kawaja? Your children? What are you? We are expecting you or your children to be somebody in South Sudan. But here you're dating Kawaja. How are you going to represent us? And all that and all that. And I just let him talk for a long time. So I'm like, hey, bro, I really apologize. But yeah, that's my life. That's that's how it is like and all that. So I, he's still insisting. I said, hey, it is not because I cannot talk. That's why I'm quiet. Actually, I can talk. Did you want me to tell you what is in my mind? He said, yeah, why are you dating the Kawaja? I'm like, okay, now listen to me really good. You all such Sudanese men, listen to me really, really good. And then the girls too, listen to me very, very good. We such Sudanese ladies, honest to God, we are responsible women. We are respectful women. We are, you know, like, really, we are family people. Like, you know, we like family and all that. But this is the thing. This is the thing with our Sudanese men. The educated Sudanese men. The smart Sudanese men. The one who look really good like you can. Those ones. Those types. Like the good, 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 good Sudanese men. You know what I'm talking about. Like the husband material. The husband type of a man. Those guys. You know. Those cute, cute Sudanese this is what they do. Do you know what they do for us? These people, they do not come for us. The moment they are educated, they go for Kawaja. They go for uh, black American. I mean African American, like not Sudanese, you know. They go for South African. They go for West African. They just go for people. They do not come for Sudanese, basically. They do not come for Sudanese ladies. They go out there and marry whatever it is they want to marry. Those are the successful handsome hard-working educated Sudanese men that is what they do they go out there so for us the Sudanese ladies you know who comes to us the drunkard they come for us the drug addict you you don't want to breathe they come for us yeah, they come for us. You know, they are more kids out. They come for us. The Sudanese ladies. Ali homeless. They come for us. 
yeah the Sudanese ladies and so just because we want just because our parents or our community or the Sudanese people want us to marry the Sudanese we need to accept them just like that accept them just like that and marry them hey! no 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 we do we are responsible we, we are going we are going since you guys think you are so responsible you cannot come for us we are also going so i'll be getting tired those are the ones that we need to marry hey i'll be going those are the ones that we need to marry for what for who you guys also have daughters out there oh. do not do that you guys also have daughters out there you want your daughter to marry a very very nice man a responsible man a good looking man like just a you know that top man that's how you want your daughter that's what you want your daughter to marry so for us girls you just want me you just want us to marry such any sasurinese that come you want us to marry them because they're sasurinese as a bro super and like hey bin azul zojuma sasurinese bin azul zojuma bin atongi zoju bin amakure zojuma babajere wele tamaria bin amakure zojuma wele ta jacob just because they're sasurinese sala can be girl go in ta go in ta you want me to marry that girls out there please do not do not marry somebody just because they are sudanese you want people to you want to please people you want people to talk about it. like those attention hey she married sudanese don't do that do not bring your standard really low for that you know it's not like they can change unless if they change and be somebody out there if not mm -mm. why is it that they, they educated the good good one are going out there why why Mm -hmm. And why is it that for us we just need to sit here and marry the Sudanese? Even if you are sorry, we just marry them for what? Please, we are not doing that. Personally, I'm not doing that. I will marry 10 Kawajat. I will marry 10 Kawajat. Huh? And instead of marrying this girl, a bigger color in Tadi, for what? And you want to have sympathy on us too. Have sympathy on us, the South Sudanese ladies. We are tired. We are not talking now because we cannot talk. We can talk. Huh? We can talk. If those men cannot come back to us, if they cannot come back to us, we are also going. We are also going. We are not sitting here and marrying all these ones that are going to give us headache, malaria, typhoid, coronavirus, cancer, sunusuno every day. No. No. They are going to give us too much headache, 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 headache every day. Too much coronavirus every day. Like we cannot even sleep. Too much, too much typhoid every day in our mock here. No, we are not marrying those ones. We also want those ones, the ones that are going out there. Those are the ones that we want. Let them come back. If they cannot come back, we are also going. We are going, girls. Please, please, please. Marry somebody that you'll be excited with. Do not marry somebody that will give you too much headache. Too much headache. Hey, this is just my little advice. So to my brothers out there, ah, for me, I'm not marrying just for the heck of it. Just to say, yeah, I got married to Sudanese. No. Hell no. No, no, no.